Hey there, I'm Dr. Ethan, and today we're going to take a look at SCP-1545, Larry the Loving Llama. This particular SCP is classified as safe, so no need to worry about any containment breaches with this one. Let's dive in and see what makes Larry so special. SCP-1545, also known as Larry the Loving Llama, is to be securely contained in Containment Locker 1545 at Site 40. Access to SCP-1545 is restricted to personnel with a clearance level of 3, 3, or higher. Any attempt to access SCP-1545 without proper authorization is strictly prohibited. SCP-1545 1545's anomalous effects only manifest when it is worn. Individuals who wear SCP-1545 will embody the persona of Larry the Loving Llama, with the person in front speaking and acting as if they were the Llama, while the person in the back performs various movements. SCP-1545 itself exhibits a very peaceful and gentle demeanor. Once inside SCP-1545, individuals are physically unable to exit without being pulled out, and they show no desire to do so, although they do not resist removal. Unless forcibly removed, individuals will continue to act as Larry the Loving Llama until they expire. Even if their partner dies, individuals will still embody the persona of Larry the Loving Llama until they also expire. Once removed from SCP-1545, individuals remember their time inside, but they do not recall its anomalous properties. They also do not exhibit any negative feelings towards their time inside SCP-1545 and behave as if their actions were normal. Authorities discovered SCP-1545 in an abandoned suburban home in, Redacted, where the victims had died from dehydration. Autopsy results revealed that the person in the back had died a day earlier and had severe bruising from being dragged throughout the household by the person in the front. After the anomalous properties of SCP-1545 were discovered, Foundation personnel confiscated it and administered Class A amnestics. The audio log 1545A features an interview with D5362, who had just been removed from SCP-1545 after being inside for approximately three hours. Dr. Fredericks asks about D5362's experience inside the SCP-1545 and D5362 expresses feeling exhausted but mentions the importance of keeping the people entertained. Dr. Fredericks questions the idea of staying inside SCP-1545 and not leaving to get a drink, but D5362 insists on maintaining the illusion. Dr. Fredericks seems puzzled by the idea of a talking llama wearing rain boots being an illusion, but D5362 defends the character of Larry the Loving Llama. In the audio log 1545b, D5483 is interviewed as the voice of Larry the Loving Llama after being inside SCP-1545 for two days. Dr. Fredericks addresses D5483 as Larry and asks about how he is feeling. D5483 responds with enthusiasm, mentioning some physical discomfort but seems oblivious to the reality of the situation, even referring to the deceased D5484 as simply taking a nap. Despite Dr. Frederick's attempts to inform D5483 about the death of D5484, D5483 remains convinced that his helpers are just napping and that they all bring joy to everyone. 